but Ivysaur versus Sa um, Samus for this match in particular because like Charizard just like goes through any projectile, which is basically Ivysaur's neutral. Yeah, it's gonna eat through Razor Leaf. Clean. <laughs> Stay yeah, we jamming. jamming. We jamming, man. Let's go. All right, Town and City. One, big go. stage. Yeah, big stage. Uh, low blast zone, or <clears throat> not low blast zones, but uh, close side blast zones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, to my surprise, Zephyr's actually going to bleed with the Ivy Sword. Yep, has to contend right now with uh, Bomb Lich trapping. Ooh, that was such good coverage there by Sage Hazard with the bomb to cover the roll from Ledge as he set up the, uh, the up tilt. Up he had a shield. Yep, and the platforms are gone. You now have to play on Final Destination. Okay. Devin's been uh, getting put off stage a lot right now. Actually, getting hit by the bomb there, the much better outcome than getting hit by the Samus grab, I think. I gotta give credit to Devin though, because um, Samus is a very dangerous ledge trapper in, in this game. So the fact that like he's, like, he's getting the least worst case scenarios when he when he is getting ledge trapped, and he's actually gonna take the first off because of that. Yeah, great timing there with the uh, the vine whip. Oh, that was and, very suspect DI. And yeah, like you said, sometimes, especially when it comes to a character as adept at ledge trapping as Samus, you know, sometimes you gotta go with the lesser of two evils in yes. what you're getting hit by. But right there, Stage Hazard uh, taking the fir uh, Devin's first stock without any extra credit on the board. Okay, I like just the walk up F kill right there. Uh, as a uh, uh, call out anti air. Ooh, but like you were saying right there, just charge shot, even just a mid charge shot, just ate right through Razor Leaf. Yeah, so I'm really curious, like, um, what is it about this matchup that Devin had, um, would actually lead to Ivysaur for? And just pretty much taking to Ivysaur most of the match. We have yet to see Charizard come into play. Alright, good timing to avoid the bombs. Yep, and they're using the uh, Town and City platforms to uh, mix up his uh, getting back to stage, which I have to feel probably definitely informed Devin's pick here for uh, <coughs> for game one. Cool. Back, and the sweet spot of the back of uh, landing back here from Sam is actually going to take the second stop. And, oh, finally some uh, Charizard gameplay. Going to get the cover throw. And this is bad. Ooh, Charizard's a big body. Ooh, okay. The uh, Pokemon Switch there gave Devin plenty of time to react to the fact that Sage Hazard was charging the down smash. Looking for a, a pretty cheesy kill. All right, Vine Whip putting Sage Hazard back off stage. The same attack, but Sam, uh, Samus has a pretty good recovery. Yep, and now the uh, TNC helping Stage Hazard out. Whoa, I'm surprised. We try to get the shield grab out of shield. I'm legitimately surprised that Stage Hazard had time to jab after that. Oh yeah, Devin just hasn't been able to find this kill right now. He's been looking for these grabs. Down throw. I'm okay. surprised that kill. I don't think I've ever seen that nope. kill. Never either. But 122 right now on Devin. Not not looking pretty right now. Yeah, no. Soon he's gonna be an up throw green. Yeah, and you know, bring it back, bringing it back to what we said before about taking the okay, yeah, taking the lesser of two evils for ledge trapping. You know, that chip, it it stacks up. Mm -hmm. Like it or not, it is damage. Mm -hmm. okay, let's see, stage hazard banning Smashville, and yeah, Kalos. I was gonna say Kalos. I, Super agree with Kalos right there. Yeah. Making sure that uh, Devin is not gonna have any any help or any consistent help getting back to stage, mm -hmm. like we saw earlier in game one. <clears throat> and Devin has opted to run it back to Town and City. Yeah, I think I think he was playing uh, pretty much okay. I uh, although I still I'm still a little um, skeptical about the oh, Ivy Sword lead, but hey. Um, we're gonna we're gonna kick it right here to game two. Yeah, I think uh, what Devin needed in game one was finding that uh, he needed to find that kill because when he wasn't able to find that second stock, 
it just got worse and worse for him. It kind of snowballed. Yeah. And, and that was, we also noticed that like um, his panic option started to um, become more apparent. Yeah, we definitely saw a couple like a in couple rolls. rolls in a yeah. row. But right now, sitting in neutral in this game too. Right now, Devin seems to be playing a lot more patient, and he's been finding some good openings for it. Well, I like the movement there by Sage Hazard. Mm -hmm. Trying to find a pivot grab. Gonna trade with Epto. Ooh, looking for the confirm. I think a little too early in percentages right now. And now you're back off stage. Ooh, Ooh okay, that was a cute confirm. Ooh. I think Devin even scouted oh, that out it? that air dodge. And right there, using the Town & City platforms, uh, perfect spacing for the, uh, the Vine Whip. Getting Devin a pretty early kill, you know, relatively speaking, compared to game one. See if we can rack up any extra credit right now. Ooh, air dodges into stage. That it? Yep. Stage hazard uh, scouted out that jump right there, especially by setting up the bomb. Oh, Ooh, okay. Go to the side. cute. Yeah, no, it doesn't work like that. No, unfortunately. And stage hazard getting a quick charge shot combo and another one uh, catching Devin coming in with buttons. Up till anti air. Very suddenly, Devin is in some very red percentages. Ooh, okay. That was close. I think that may have missed because Stage Hazard angled it up. Yeah, he did. Stuck against yeah, these very bombs scary. right now. Is that it? No, Town and City's really high. Yeah, Town and City helping him out. Now Devin does get to play the game, tries to catch Stage Hazard going above the platform, but it's a little bit too late, finds a bomb instead. DBZ and Stage Hazard is the one to win it. All right, Charizard are gonna come into play. Ooh, catches that charge shot. Forward I don't, throw? yeah, I was gonna say, I, up throw definitely not gonna do it. <laughs> Hello, oh Town and City. The structure. Ooh, that was a very scary down air. Oh, I thought we were going to see the up the shield, but uh, uh, Sage Hazard was up the other shield first. Well, okay, so only 52% right now on Devin. Certainly very doable, but Stage Hazard's been been making this chip count, and mm -hmm. before you know it, before you know it, you're at 100. Ooh, okay. Oh, is that going to do it? No, nope, No, okay. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if Devin wanted that second Vine Whip, I think. I think if he hadn't done the second Vine Whip, I think he definitely would have made it back to stage. Yeah, because like the um, when he used Vine Whip, it kind of like stopped his momentum. Yeah, you only get that little like vertical hop in the air for the first time, yeah. for the first Vine Whip. But yeah, not switching to Charizard in time, and actually going to uh, lose game two right here. Unfortunate. Mm -hmm. We hate to see our boy like this. Yeah, that was a great setup right there. That. That caught me off guard. Mm -hmm. It definitely caught Sage Hazard off guard. I gotta say, man, every time I see like any fire move and Ivysaur, I, I just think about Brawl. <laughs> I'm like, what? What if this was Brawl? I'm fine with it not yep. being. <laughs> <seeing. laughs> yeah, that was just that was just upsetting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, definitely not how you want to go out. But I think that's just one of those things where, like, you should realize that, like, okay, I didn't reach the ledge at that point. I think I should switch. Yeah.